Welcome to Bangladesh. You're standing here in one of the largest refugee camps in the world. And if you look around behind you, you'll get a sense of what that means. In only a few months, over half a million people have settled here, fleeing from neighboring Myanmar, which is just a few kilometers from here, and leaving everything behind them and coming to a place which until then was just barren land with absolutely no facilities. As a gesture of solidarity from the European people, the European Union funds humanitarian aid projects here in the form of food distributions, access to clean water and sanitation facilities, nutritional support and access to basic health care. Every day, this kitchen, which is run by our partner, Action Against Hunger, cooks thousands of hot meals, which are then trucked to the camp to be distributed to refugees. More specifically, those newly arrived who haven't been able to settle down yet, or those who have just been relocated to new areas as part of camp management. For most people, this is the only cooked meal of the day. Many of the Rohingya refugees have suffered traumatic experiences before arriving here. Men were beaten, women were raped, and many children witnessed horrible scenes. The living conditions in the camp also create a lot of stress, and gender-based violence is common. Action Against Hunger provides psychosocial support in the form of counseling, of course, but also through stress management sessions and simple therapeutic play sessions for the children. Many child-friendly spaces have also been open across the camp where the kids can find some sense of normalcy again. We hope you now have a better understanding of what the EU does in the field of humanitarian aid across the world and why it is so important to keep funding projects like these, which are saving lives on a daily basis.